2018. So long. You're out of here. Hey, y'all. Artist Poet Girl here, also known as APG Jamie. And today, it's about time. Journal. So, I've got this wheat colored, also known as a golden color, a vintage uh, copy paper. It's a little bit thicker than what we have these days, but hey, that's fabulous. They were going to throw it away at Hubby's job, but he brought home treasure for me. I've got a lot to use because it's a big, giant ream. I mean, it's even the reams are bigger than what they used to be. So anyway, these little doohickeys, uh, paper pieces, are uh, some ephemera that a friend gave me, and I just took a deckled pair of scissors and am cutting them apart. Because as you can see, I'm just going to slap them down on one of the pages for the journal. I cut down the uh, the gold wheat color, whatever. Oh, it's all about time, y'all. All about time. Mm-hmm. Did you hear it? I know you did. So, any hoots, uh, now on some of the pages, I'm going to add some of this here Grumbacher modeling paste. Look at that giant honking tub of that stuff as my rewards for being part of their art swaps. Well, guy, get that punch card over there on Facebook, send in your little artist trading card and get a cool one in return and get a punch card, gets punched and, you know, after you get however many punches you get, you get rewards and oh my, look at that big old honking big tub. And it's lovely. It dries, um, not totally white, but it's not opaque uh, or it's not translucent either. It's kind of an in betweening okay? And um, fair warning, it has an odor. Mm, yeah. So here's some of them Tim Holtz paper dolls, you know, because I love them little paper dolls. I probably don't use near as many as I should because I, I actually have a lot. I think they're adorable, stinking adorable. So some of the pages are getting a paper doll, or one page in these journals getting a paper doll, blah, blah, blah. Because I am assembly lining it, y'all. Assembly lining it, okay? Now, all the pages don't have something. I mean, you know, got to have some room to be, do your own thing. And look at that Tim Holtz typewriter. That's one of their little uh, dies, you know. Well, obviously, you know. <laughs> and it's just a silver gel pen that I'm uh, highlighting the various parts on, just like the picture they had on the package of the dye that I don't show you. Oh, hey, there is a list of ingredients in the description box below. Please click on the word more to see more. You know, because, you know, this has got more in there. And, um, and now I'm just going to measure out a piece of this green cardstock to uh, to back that width because that's going to become a tuck spot, y'all. Mm -hmm. So, um, yes, I appreciate your kind comments. Uh-huh, I really do. Your thumbs ups. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm your subscriptions and if you have not done so already I would like to take a moment to invite you to please subscribe to my channel mm -hmm. we will be going live in 2019 on third Thursdays of the month if all goes well with my internet because that's kind of you know yeah if I'm not live on the third Thursday of the month at, at uh, 10 a.m. central time it's on account of I don't got no internet just saying so, anywho, then it will just be the one day a month because, you know, I got to try it on for size. I might not like it. You might not like it. Mm, it could happen, y'all. It could happen. So, anyway, when you subscribe, click on that little uh, gray bell that's to the right of the word subscribe, and uh, you will get notifications of new videos. And uh, you'll get notifications of when I go live. Oh, it's the plan for 2019. We'll see. We're going to see how it goes. Okay? Okay. Don't expect too much. So, anywho, making a tech spot. Mm -hmm. Oh. And there's a tuck spot. I'm just putting a little bit of glue on the one end side edge that I'm going to glue. 
and I don't want too much. Okay, okay. So anyway, if um, you don't want to listen to me yammer on, because you know some people don't, and that's okay, because I don't play no musics. Mm -hmm. Cause I yammer on. Cause that's what I do. Down, uh, if you hover over, if you're on a um, mobile device or a computer, this does not work for the television, okay? Sorry, y'all. But hover over the video, and you'll see a little picture of a gear pop up. Click on that. Oh, that's to speed up or slow down the video. If you want to hurry up and go faster, or slow down and go slower. It makes my voice sound really funny. So back to the voice thing. If you don't want to hear me yammering on, there's a little speaker thing when you hover over the screen as well. And you just click that and it just shuts me right up. Pretty much like that. So y'all saw I was just stamping uh, an image onto uh, one of the pages and I here I am stamping another image. Oh, that first image is on the front cover. Okay. And this is on one of the pages because I thought it was cute because this is a time card, people. A time card journal. So it's about time and how you got to juggle stuff, you know, and how you got to keep your dreams alive and how, you know, got to be a little princess little girl sometimes because, you know, and how you got to be a good big girl, you know, big girl britches and it's about time, y'all. Journal. <laughs> oh, I said I didn't play no music. Is that true? Musical, musical, musical interlude. It's a musical interlude for you, for me, just we. Musical interlude. So that right there is some um, uh, Tim Holtz, I do believe. Excuse me, I think I'm going to cough. <laughs> that sounded fake. Anyway, um, die cuts, uh, Tim Holtz die cuts, and it's from the botanical collection, I do believe. And that's going on the front cover. Because time card's the front cover, and then time card's going to be the back cover. Okay? Well, I better check my time. Oh, oops, we're going too fast. My audio is going much faster than my video. Mm, sorry about that, y'all. So we just saw me um, adhering down some almost um, library pockets with an ATG, which is Advanced Tape Gun Glider. Now I'm putting in some faux money and a little Dilusions uh, black and white cutout thingy that somebody can color if they want to color it. So we have to get all the top edges because this is, you know, a long journal, tall journal, I guess I should say. And I'm getting all the pages, the top edges of the papers together and also um, the cover. And we're going to measure it out and whatever measurements I decided I was going to use because it'd be just whatever you're going to be using for your measurements, okay? Because we're going to do a Japanese tab binding, binding, y'all. Mm -hmm. There it goes. Now, remember when you're using your pokey tool to make your holes, you want to push down and turn so that you're kind of pushing and drilling at the same time, okay? It, it's, it, yeah. So, and sometimes you have to flip it over and poke from the other side, depending on how thick your uh, stuff is. Or you can make a template and punch half of it at a time, okay? Poke half of it at a time or not. So um, maybe our video is caught up to the audio. Audio slowed down for the video. Whichever. It's always entertaining when I go back and watch it. Because, yeah, it's like, what am I saying? Oh, please note, there was no heat gun in this video. Here's a cursory heat gun, y'all, for you. <laughs> I'm just using cro crochet cotton thread of a slight green color. Because, you know, that's what I'm using. Time card's got green ink on it. I used green ink. Money's got green ink on it. See? Mm hmm. Kind of all goes together. Now, I am not an expert binder, right? And I am no Nick the Booksmith. All right? I do okay for the kind of stuff I do. All right? I'm happy with it, and that's all that counts. But I am um, going to get get y'all a link to this chick who really has an amazing Japanese stab, stab binding tutorial. <laughs> it just sounds so bloody, doesn't it? That would be red, not green. So, 
Yeah. And the links, uh, I'll put her link in the description box below, and I'm going to try to get her in the iCard above, but I don't think I can link specifically to that video, but I will link specifically to that video below. Those of you on mobile devices can get to it, and those of you on computer can get to it, but those of you watching on TV, I am so sorry. That's not going to work for y'all yet. One day YouTube's going to get that together for us mirroring people. Just saying. Mm hmm Because it's true. So it's like in and out, over. In and out, over. In and out, over. And then when you get to the end, which you're going to say, okay, but like I said, that girl whose name I cannot think of. I am so sorry. I apologize. Um... She, she really has a super stab binding, uh, yeah. And there's some fancy stitching you can do. I've seen some uh, people do designs on that, okay? But I'm just kind of plain, just plain old Jamie, <laughs> if there's such a thing. Well, she could be. So all in all, um, I don't know how long it took me to make these books these journals. I just don't, y'all. Okay? Because I don't. I had um, probably about an hour's worth of video, and I got it whittled down to just under 18 minutes. And I'm hoping I've included enough to that you can get the gist of it, and that it inspires you to do something. All right? See that? I have one tail on one side and one tail on the other. Now I'm just going to tie a knot. Now, officially, I think you're supposed to put your knot over one of the holes and then pop it on the inside so that it disappears because it's supposed to be all nice and clean. But, you know, I want to leave tails. Okay? Because I'm going to put some little um, butterflies butterflies on on the strings which we're getting to probably right about now depending on the audio and the video link and sync and mm -hmm. so I'm just going to punch them out probably punch punch out too many showing you punching out too many and I'm using again that golden wheat color uh, copy paper it's it's almost as heavy as cardstock almost y'all and then that green is a cardstock and um, you know punching them out and then now we're going to um, use my favorite is clue ever okay now I need a front and a back for each string all right now I got two strings so that means I need four butterflies a uh, golden one for one side and a green one for the other which hopefully you're watching are you watching I'm just trimming up the little ends a little bit because, you know, they might be too long. Some of them's kind of long. Some of them might not be too long. Might not be long enough. I don't know. It'll depend on who gets the join them. Mm -hmm. So I'm using my pokey tool because it, the butterfly wanted to stick to my finger because all the glueiness going on. So that's what I'm using my pokey tool with. For. With. For. Oh, goodness gracious. Lord bless me. And so that's, here comes another string. But I'm here going to use the pokey tool to hold it because it won't turn loose my finger. Okay. And we're going to put, put it, put, go ahead. Put, put the green one on in here. All right, there we go. Goodness. So there we go. And then those little butterflies, I'm going to bling those up. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put some glitter glue on them babies. Mm -hmm. Glitter glues. I have a pale yellow and a pale green glitter glues. Now, once they get out of the bottle and onto the papers, you can't quite tell that they are, uh, you know, have color to them glitter glues, but they do. Okay. One of them's kind of gold and one of them's kind of green. Green, gold, gold, green. So, anyway, just paint that on there with a little brush and holding it with my pokey tool because, you know, kind of small, tiny little things. And I just do that for all of them because, again, uh, 
each little uh, strain is going to get a green and a gold butterfly on each side. Or not each side, one on each side. Something. I'm going to clue them on in a minute when it gets dry. And no heat gun in this video. Heat gun, no, y'all. No heat gun, y'all. <laughs> so here we are, my glue, putting it on the bigger part of the butterfly. And I'm going to smoosh it around with my uh, pokey tool. What am I going to use? Pokey tool. Just so that I can get enough of it smooshed around without it sticking to my finger. I tried to be neat for these, y'all. I did. Tried. And... Uh, so there goes the green one goes on the gold butterfly and then the gold one is going to go on the green butterfly and then I'm going to flip them over and repeat. I'm going to show you that part. Okay? And then I'm going to need just a little more glue so I'm just going to get it off the tip of the bottle there with my pokey tool. Mm -hmm. How's our time? Oh, we're just a little ahead. And there's a green goes on the gold one. And the gold one's going to go on the green one any day. Thanks everyone so much for your subscriptions. I've so enjoyed uh, making these YouTube videos. I hope I have been able to inspire you the last few years that I've been making videos. I look forward to it to continuing my efforts okay okay and uh, oh that's just a hair band we're going to use to hold that shut not that it needs to be held shut but once once the people get these they might need to um, squash it out because they might be adding stuff to it so we got a photo montage <laughs> mm, that was fancy for photo montage close up see stab binding that's so cool. Mine's not perfectly straight, but hey, it's perfect for me. Just saying. Anyway, once again, I appreciate each and every one of you. I hope you've had superb holidays, that you've been safe and healthy. I uh, wish you joy, happiness, love, good health in the upcoming year of 2019. And uh, disclaimer screen. <laughs> Thanks for watching and happy arting y'all.